What is up everybody, it is Saints Fan, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get submarines in GTA Online. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more daily awesome GTA content. Alright, so this is the place you want to come, and I'll actually show the location here in a second, but as you saw right there, there's actually nothing in the water. So, sometimes it doesn't spawn, you have to actually go out and, I mean, I'm not going to show it because I'll cut it out, but I basically just went around the corner, got in a car, drove a couple, you know, blocks away, and then came back, and then it spawned there. Now, one thing I also want to mention is I think you need to be a certain level, because I had some people tell me that, you know, they were a lower level and they didn't actually get it to spawn, even though they came back a number of times. So, if it's not spawning for you, just maybe rank up and then try again, or just get a friend who is a high enough, you know, a really high level to come here and get it for you. Now as you see right here, like I said, I went around the corner and I came back and now it is spawned there. And where this is at, this actually is like the lowest part or you know the south, the most south part in GTA. I'll show the full map here in a second so you can sort of get an idea of uh, where you gotta go. But it's basically under this little like uh, hangar. And like I said, sometimes it spawns here, sometimes it doesn't. You just gotta get lucky. But what you can actually do, and I'll show here also, you can actually get multiple of these because it basically works like the helicopters and stuff. And if you're not familiar, you can take a helicopter uh, where it spawns at, then fly away and then come back, and then another one will have spawned. So you can do that actually with the submarine as well, so you can drive it away and then drive it back, and you can get another one, and then you can do this a number of times and get as many submarines as you want. So then you can have like an underwater crew going or something like, you know, pop out on somebody that's just out there in the ocean or, you know, whatever. But it's pretty cool, obviously it's like this exact same submarine from single player, so it's not that great, you know, it goes really slow. Although it, it is in a better location, you can actually get out in the ocean now. Because uh, before you were sort of like uh, at the, the shore, so it's kind of, you know, shallow, but here they actually put it in a deep location so you can, you know, get it out easily without getting stuck on different rocks and stuff. And then maybe, I don't know, you guys can go find some stuff in the ocean, maybe they added some different things in multiplayer than they did with single player, maybe there's some uh, really cool easter eggs out in the ocean or something. I don't know, but this is pretty cool. If you do this, let me know if you find anything out in the ocean, I'll, you know, we'll go test it out, go see if it's there on one of my live streams. But that is it with this video, hope you guys enjoyed, like I said at the beginning, like the video if you did and thought it was helpful, subscribe for more awesome GTA content, and as always, it's your boy Saints Venomo, peace!